you get yeah for for the church folks. I mean for the church folks that be in that well, you know when you at the altar uh-huh. and that spirit just <laughs> What's good, boy? Yeah. <laughs> Let him use you. Let him use you. <laughs> That's why y'all use each other. <laughs> Not the one dagger. <laughs> you can't tell. Man, me. listen. Folks been spamming my stream. They been talking about where Peggy at. Man, I'm going to jump out down that street. You know man. what I'm saying? They hit me with the Peggy. It's like, <laughs> oh, bro, bro it, it's just love, man. Yeah. It's love, man. I've been, I've really been enjoying this content creating stuff because, like, a person may ask why. It's like, think about it. Not a lot of football players have faces. That's true. But, bro, hold on. We got to circle. We got to circle that back, though. I got to give you, and it's not just because of me when you said that, and I know this is your story, but I have to give you your flowers About on what? that. The football players having faces. Years ago, you've been on this. Mm-hmm. Pushing Iconic Saga. I want a production company. I'm going to do it this way. And everybody has something to say. Close, far away, like, bro, you're doing too much. That don't make sense. Cam walking around with people with cameras and everything, but you always wanted to do it your way. You always was a trailblazer, yeah. and even though you might have got crucified for it at certain times, you just kept going. And so I gotta give you your flowers because a lot of people, but they ain't like that. And you know what I'm saying. So I, I gotta show you love in front of everybody because you've been about this, and your face deserved to, deserve to be seen, brother. Because you don't you don't lay the groundwork. Mafia, you know, you know, you know, you know. Shit. Got to. Yeah, bro, I really, because let me tell you something. The reason why I feel so, like, I stand on business in regards to content, because first off, content is king. Mm-hmm. Right? If it wasn't king, media rights, why is that so expensive? Mm, that's true. You dig what I'm saying? Yeah. Nah. In regards to me, I never gave a damn, never gave a fuck, never cared about what you had to say about me. Yeah, yeah, Let's just, yeah. look, I, I ain't got all the money, but I got some money, so you can keep your little two cents. <laughs> that ain't paying for nothing. It ain't paying child support. It ain't paying no tuition. It ain't paying for my dinner, my breakfast, lunch, or whatever. Mm-hmm. And the damn show ain't paying for my clothes. Talk to him, bud. Now, with that being said, uh-huh. Peggy. What's up, bud? Appreciate the flowers. Thank you. But nigga, I didn't need it. <laughs> I'm going to throw rocks at you next time, nigga. <laughs> and I'm going to throw them back. Because <laughs> I'm going to tell you this, Peggy. What's up, bud? Even though you took your time and you plucked out your little daisies and your weeds and your dandelions and your roses and your tulips. <laughs> Roses still yeah, smell, smell like, like boo, 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 boo. Yeah. yeah, like come on, man. I'm good. I'm good. Cause this is the thing. They don't want you to know what you what you need to know. Oh, that's what like, mean. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Say what 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 what, 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 what was it? Uh huh. You trying to do what? And I'm like, okay, cool. If y'all doing it like this, I'm a fan of so many different shows, so many different networks, so many different you know, pieces of production. So I'm like, man, they missing something though. Mm-hmm. And this is the thing that, like I say, baby boomers, millennials, Gen Z, they, it's like a voice box that they sometimes miss. Mm-hmm. And it's authenticity. So for yeah. me, I'm sitting up here saying like, even though it may come out crazy, we're like, hey, man, y'all stop all that cursing and this. <laughs> but I remember watching <laughs> Dear Mama, uh-huh. Tupac documentary. Gotcha. And I don't think it's the words more than the intentions behind the words Mm. that should go into consideration. Because a lot of times people lose full control of what they're trying to say, but that doesn't mean they lose the control of what they're trying to get across. Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah, I get you. Man, he went into this church Mm -hmm. and was cursing. 
man, motherfuckers is this, that, and third. And like, man, we got to do this and we got to do that. Now, granted, I come from a church, <laughs> Pentecostal. You get slapped whoa, 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 whoa. You know, it's, but the message, and real. you can't fault the messenger when he has a beautiful message. Yeah. Sometimes it comes out, you know, I come out. Yeah. So, that's my thing, Becky. I just used this platform that y'all beautiful people at Iconic Side Gun gave me. Y'all believed in a little bit of me, and I believed in tiny y'all. <laughs> no, no, not tiny. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can, I can. talk about Peggy. We'll get some straightening going. It's on. okay. It's all right. But I really enjoy what I do, man, and I, I enjoy it because people, they look at it, and they're like, yo, Cam funny. Mm -hmm. I'm like, nigga, <laughs> I'm just being me. Being uniquely you. You know what I'm saying? So with that being said, Piggy, I mean, I'm sorry for just holding up your time. <laughs> I mean, God, so oh, my. We man. got a damn we show. We got to give run. people the show now.